14 years old, Stephanie Rivera immigrated to Mexico from her native Honduras with the dream of one day going to beauty school. But because she was in Mexico illegally, she was denied enrollment. My father always told us that getting an education was the most important, but I was never able to do it. Stephanie sells cupcakes on the streets of Mexico City and is fearful she might be deported. But that soon may all change. Next January, Mexico launches a program that will legalize up to 10,000 illegal foreigners. It will allow immigrants who have been in the country for at least two years to apply for a work permit and a temporary four-year residence visa. The program comes amid an ongoing immigration crisis on Mexico's southern border with Guatemala. Thousands from Central America are fleeing gang violence and crossing into Mexico to reach the U.S. Government officials say Mexico's 2012 immigration law was created to help overhaul an antiquated and complicated system. The law made it easier for illegal immigrants to gain residency and get citizenship. Maria Fernanda Garcia is an official at Mexico's National Migration Institute. These are people who have already made their lives here. That is why we believe they need to be legalized and not criminalized. We believe in giving them their papers so they can go on to live dignified lives. They will now be able to legally work and walk down the street without having the fear of being deported. While no immigration registry exists, the Mexican government estimates between 10,000 and 15,000 immigrants are living illegally in the country. Thanks to this new program, Stephanie Rivera and other immigrants won't fear deportation. Instead, they will finally have stability to continue on with their lives. Marta Markovitz, CCTV, Mexico City.